Okay, now we are at the the, uh, the step where we need to put the front pulley back together. But uh, in order to uh, to make this easier, we must loosen the belt. And in in order to uh, loosen the belt, we must uh, make the belt go further inside the back pulley. And the way to do this, you see, the, the, this is the uh, outer outer uh, outer part where the, the 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 belt goes in, and this here is the inner part. So what we need to do in order to loosen the belt is to squeeze the outer part towards the outside, towards the clutch. This is the clutch, okay? This is the... So you put your fingers between where the belt goes and then you squeeze the outer, the out the, the, this, this, this piece here outside you squeeze it between the uh, you squeeze it uh, towards the the, the, the the clutch this is hard to explain but you see if I put my fingers inside where the belt goes and my other hand squeeze the belt and then I squeeze with my finger here I can loosen the belt at the same time. Okay, loosen the belt as much as you can. Okay, push the belt like this. So you can now you see the belt is much loose. Do uh, as much as you can. This will only help you into taking a uh, putting back uh, the front pulley. Now as you can see uh, the bell is quite loose. Before the belt was tight like this around the front pulley now it's much looser and uh, if the belt is loose like this uh, it will be much easier to put everything back together so now we are at the step of putting uh, placing everything back together so now that the belt is loose it will be easier so you put this part do not put the small washer, the restrictor, okay? You want it to be, you, want, you don't want that. So uh, leave it aside, keep it in order to, uh, if you ever have to uh, bring back your scooter for uh, warranty repairs, uh, you, you, will, you may want to put it back together to put the washer back because if your dealer sees that you removed it he might tell you that uh, since you have modified your scooter uh, the warranty will be uh, would be cancelled so uh, keep this washer and put it back if uh, if needed so now you put this piece back in as far as it can go now give some slack to the belt and push this back. Now place the one-way clutch. The one-way clutch there is uh, dents. There are, are uh, lots of tiny grooves in there that matches the grooves in the uh, in the main axle. So when you put the one-way clutch into the main axle like this the one-way clutch should not be rotating, should be uh, locked in. See, I tried to turn the one-way clutch and it doesn't. 
when I when it's pushed. This is why it is it is uh, quite much easier to put everything back together when the belt is loose because if the belt is tight then the one way clutch might not be go deep enough. I hope you uh, understand what I mean. After you placed the one way clutch you have to place the big washer and the nut. I referred this to uh, as a bolt before but uh, I now uh, understand my mistake. There is a difference between a nut and a bolt. So this is a nut. Put a nut. Screw the nut onto the main axle making sure the one-way clutch is properly seated screw it by hand as far as possible then I would suggest you use the 17 millimeter socket with the extension and use it as a screwdriver and screw it as far as you can by hand like this now it is uh, rather tight but not tight enough now the nut must be rather tight okay uh, in the service manual of the C3 it says if I remember correctly that the, this bolt must be tightened to uh, 30 pounds or something using a torque wrench you know a torque wrench is a, a quite expensive tool again that can be used to uh, measure precisely how tight uh, something a uh, bolt or a nut is but since I don't have a torque wrench and uh, you probably don't have a torque wrench either so uh, I would say you do it uh, as carefully as you can as tight apply the same force to tighten this as the force you use to loosen it okay before you have to take apart this bolt try to remember how much pressure you have to uh, you had to uh, to apply in order to untighten it, tighten it and uh, apply the same pressure to tighten it so uh, in order to do this I will recommend you to not use the extension and uh, install the 17 millimeter socket directly in the ratchet and you again I will use the BOA constrictor what a name uh, this time with the Mastercraft logo facing in order to tighten everything so install the BOA constrictor carefully around the front part of the front pulley tighten the belt as much as you can and then make sure the belt is even all around because if it is not even the belt will slip off when you try to tighten the bolt with the ratchet so now it's time to tighten the bolt it's not as easy as it looks this is the the tricky part see now 